Okay, and now on to the next mission. Eliminate the Renegade Threat, which I actually believe for everything except the mission itself is the hardest mission in the game. Boss, the mission objective is to eliminate two U.S. Marines officials. What I meant by it's hard for everything except what's in the game is that the mission itself is easy once you learn this one specific uh, what amounts to a shortcut. Also, right here, I am deliberately sprinting to catch the attention of a guard that's down there. This means that they won't run up the hill and, like, get out of the way super fast. I was not actually attempting to fire. All I was doing there was just trying to mark them. Now here, they'll be closer and walking slower so you can get an easier headshot. Which is, of course, the difficulty with me. And another, right here is another difficult headshot. But it's first followed by something where it's like, okay, you don't need a headshot. All you need is to be able to knock this guy out eventually. So yes, right here is about a couple of misses. But the difficult thing about the non-main mission stuff with this mission is that it asks so much of you. Um, notably is that it asks you to complete the mission with no weapons, without getting caught by anyone, without killing anyone, and by extracting the, the targets. That is a tall order. I actually have done it once. My, ti my time that's recorded is 1 hour and 20 minutes. And, uh, yeah, for not having to go that long, I'll go... I think I'll take this one. I was actually attempting to recreate the the extract targets but use weapons sort of category. But it was... it's so annoying to, to pull out, so I decided to instead just do the shortcut method. To the east, the two were a reason to be afraid of the dark. The extradition to face trial is even on the table in the peace talks. Now that they're out of Laos, the two are enjoying a relaxing... So, yeah, the... I'm having a bit of difficulty here actually spotting my next target. You can spot them relatively early if you catch the... If you, like, first portion of the style, or first portion of the cycle is completed in time. But, unfortunately, it's... A bit of hard timing. So yeah, just keep looking around for a bald man. That's really the only way to distinguish between the two. A bald guy and a black guy wearing sunglasses. So yes, I think I actually miss him right there. Like, right there would be where he's first visible over the fence. Rip. So yes, the... Uh, objective was to eliminate them, so here we go. First one. one, target down, one to go. His buddy's on his way to hell. That's a shot that is very easy to accidentally mess up. So yeah, and just getting out of dodge. Not choosing to tranquilize a guard relatively early on let me like tranquilize the other guard easier, but means I gotta tranquilize him on the way back. Uh, while we're waiting for the helicopter, I'm actually going to show you the, um, ID stuff that Miller was talking about. Target A, Glass, the I. He was stationed in that prison camp before being sent to Laos. The place is their old haunt. That's target B, Polis, the finger. Apparently he's still finding uses for his skills, even now that he's out of the war. Those nicknames had nothing to do with their skills. It's because the two were less than human. No heart. Just an eye to find their prey and a finger to pull the trigger. Remember their faces. Such scoundrels. This is Morpho, on station at LZ. Yes, there's a bit of audio overlap, but that was because uh, that audio was taken from my uh, attempts at doing this while getting orba um while attempting to extract both targets. Don't worry, I will show the ending audio to if you do that, but I'm not gonna make it a, a big mission or anything because it is too elaborate. I can get as far as getting one of the guys out and also getting two of the POWs from that camp down there, but getting the eye out of the tower is one of the most annoying things to possibly 
get started at all. And here's my score. I'm stunned, boss. I'm glad we're on the same side. You might be able to cut out like a minute here, and even more than that since you can technically start out with the sniper rifle. But, yeah, that's pretty good for like not going for either one of those. Or sorry, for, for not having great aim and for not having practiced a lot of this in a while. Like, I think that was take three that I got this on. With those two targets out of the way, we might just see an early end to the war. But did you notice, boss? They seem to be afraid of something. Feared it more than death itself. Just what the hell is going on in that place? Now here's the double extraction audio. We searched the two targets you recovered. One of them had a glass eye, the other a prosthetic index finger. Looks like all the therapy and drugs couldn't help them forget the war. They resorted to self-mutilation. But you can't cut off your name, just like us. They were human. See you guys next time.